Hi, this is Valerie from CharmingValerie.com and I recently um, had my first experience getting a blowout uh, in Dallas, uh, South Lake actually. The hair bar has opened up and um, they are they do drop-in blowouts and so basically you can go there and get a shampoo, um, what is it, a shampoo, a blowout, and a style and that service is I think it's about like $35 the one that I got was $35 and so I'm gonna do a review of the place um the first thing is I yeah I went to their location that's in South Lake and it is a very very beautiful store like it's definitely I mean a beautiful salon it's definitely a place that you're gonna want to go there and hang out with your friends and it's really modern and it's like decorated beautifully and um, yeah, and so basically I sat down, uh, I had a stylist named Whitley, and I had asked for someone who's familiar with um, working on extensions and stuff, and so they did. They hooked me up with the perfect person, and um, yeah, so she gave, she handed me this iPad thing, it was actually an iPad, and it had all their different uh, styles and all the different services that they do, so it was like an iPad menu. And I also had a mimosa, <laughs> that's a huge plus in my book is that you know they serve nice drinks and stuff so you can just go and relax and have a good time while you get your hair done so, anyway so yeah and so you get to get your hair done and so you have an iPad I chose to get like this tousled um, blow-dry kind of wavy style um, and so that was $35 uh, they also do makeup applications they do extensions and um, yeah and so and they also do like private parties and stuff like that if you want to have like a girls night out or a girls day out or something and so yeah there's that part so I get there I relax I'm drinking my mimosa I'm getting my hair washed and and styled and stuff and I was feeling I was feeling pretty good and so um yeah so I got my hair done and styled and uh they use Moroccan oil products and my stylist Whitley she made sure she that I knew how to take care of my blowout and so since I don't I didn't really know what to expect like the first day I had it done I was like oh this is great my hair's done like yay how awesome that's cool but I didn't know what to expect you know like how long it would last or anything um I told Whitley that my expectation was uh, about two weeks until I was planning on going again and so she thought that was reasonable so I was like okay let's see what what this whole blowout thing is about <laughs> okay so one of the things I heard about extending the life of your blowout is that you're supposed to um, like sleep with your hair wrapped up with like a silk silk scarf or something and I use a silk pillow or actually I use a satin pillow so um, for me that was good enough that worked and so uh, I didn't really realize how awesome having a blowout was and having it professionally done was until um, I was at the beauty live event um, at the Galleria and so all day I was I was taking my hair up and down and all this stuff and I noticed after I took my hair out of the bun that it um, it was like beautiful and straight and I just brushed it out normally if I put my hair in a bun the elastic rubber band thing will put like kind of a crease in it and so I'll have to flat iron it again but I did not flat iron my hair like no joke I didn't flat iron my hair for two weeks <laughs> I still I mean yeah um, and so I didn't have to flat iron my hair for two weeks. That's just awesome for me because I normally have to do it every single day. So um, I divided the cost of the blowout by like the two weeks. So that's like two fifty a day. So I was paying. So for the thirty five dollar hair, you know, without a tip, thirty five dollar hair blowout was I guess. So yeah, I'm paying like two fifty per day for two weeks to not have to. Um, to not have to straighten my hair and stuff so it's saving me major time like it's seriously I am one of those people who likes to sleep as long as possible and it's it saved me a lot of time because I haven't been that doing any, I haven't even been putting any products or anything in my hair and so I heard that is also one of the things that helps you extend the life of your blowout and so I've just had like this perfect looking effortless hair which I did not think any of those things could happen together honestly but it did and um, I'm ready to book <laughs> another appointment. Uh, I think that I will definitely be going every two weeks. You know, and also people can buy you packages. That's one of the cool things is this is what I'm going to ask for for Mother's Day. So if my husband's watching, um, yes, what I would like for Mother's Day is a blowout package. And so, um, yeah, someone can buy you like however many blowouts, free, prepaid blowouts for you to go and use and like, <laughs> yes, yeah. 
So, um, there's that. Uh, the salon is uh, woman owned. Uh, it's owned by Gina Ginsburg. And um, she's like a, a Dallas person, I guess, if you guys aren't familiar. Um, oh, yeah, if you guys watched Most Eligible Dallas, uh, that's Drew's stepmom, Gina. And so, um, yeah, I got to meet her and she told me all about the salon and stuff. And she told me that they're planning on opening more salons all over. Like, there's going to be one in Plano and one in Dallas. I think maybe at Preston Royal or something like that. But anyway. Yeah, there's going to be more locations, and honestly, for now, <laughs> I plan on driving to South Lake to get my hair done because I really like my stylist, and I really enjoy going to South Lake and shopping and hanging out while I'm out there. So, yeah. Um, but, basically, uh, that's my review of, <laughs> of um, the hair bar drop and blow out. And so even if you can't go to the hair bar in Dallas, if you don't live in Dallas, I would definitely seek out like a blowout bar or going to a salon or something. Um, I've seen more places, you know, advertising blowouts and stuff. So I definitely recommend getting one because it's just kind of amazing. I mean, uh, yeah, I can't tell you how much time I've saved. And one day, like I shouldn't even be admitting this, but one day I, I did not brush my hair all day. Like I had my hair in a bun. I was just on mommy duty doing stuff all day. And then the next day, whenever I took my hair down, and I was like brushing it and combing through all the tangles and stuff, it looked perfect again. So that was just a true testament to me of the power of a blowout. And yeah, so I could go on all day about this, but I'm not. Um, so yay blowouts. <laughs> anyway, uh, thanks for watching. Let me know if you've ever had a blowout. I would love to know that. Uh, I'm interested also in learning how to do them myself. Well, actually, no, I'm not interested in learning how to do them myself. I personally like going and having my hair played with for an hour. Um, but, you know, that might be something you might want to look into, or I would definitely post information on my blog if you guys are interested in that sort of thing. Uh, yeah, so... Come visit my blog, <laughs> charmedvalerie.com. Find me on Twitter and on Instagram and on, on Pinterest and all that fun stuff because I, I just like to share new fun stuff with you guys. So, yes, thanks for watching.